Now watch me whip. Kill it. Now watch me nay nay. Okay. Now watch me whip. Whip. Watch me nay nay. Why me do? Hey guys, what is up? It is Mav coming at you with a yet another Grand Theft Auto 5 video. And today's video, let's uh, post two videos today. Um, today's video will be a strategy video on how to get a, a special crate drop more efficiently and get there quicker and get it quicker and get in and get out. So the first thing I would do is I just got alert saying 10 hours. So when it gets 10 hours, I would start heading to go where you have like a ride I suggest a fast helicopter not a Hydra Hydras are fast if you want it you can get a Hydra I personally don't like flying my Hydra I personally like a Frogger I know this seems weird but it's nice and fast the Swift is pretty fast too but I personally like my Frogger more you want a plane that you know the new golden planes you can't put on pass mode so you don't want them you want this one of these planes that you can put on pass mode and what you do all you want to do is I, I what I would do I just put on pass mode and I'd make my way, may, my way up to May's Bank and until it says five hours when it says fire is, I would make sure I'm at Maze Bank, getting ready, looking around. I'd get on my map, look around, see who's in the heli, see where their vantage point is. So you got one guy over here. It looks like he is at a vantage point. You got other people. It, as soon as it says that, there's going to be a lot of people you'll notice getting their plans to get in the heli, all right? Because they get them pretty quick. And this is for special crate drops or any kind, any type of crate drops. I'm doing this video um, especially for special crate drops because they're supposed to be a high frequency this weekend. And what I would do is definitely get a frogger. Or a helicopter, wherever you want, and I would get on Maze Bank and wait till it says. And as soon as it gets to three hours, I would definitely get in the sky, get ready in the sky, and get ready for it to spawn. Uh, personally, when you're about, when you see the green area where it's gonna drop, I personally put on. If you haven't unlocked, go off radar, and s try to stay nice and low because everyone usually flies high. I've noticed because they try parachuting out. I suggest flying nice and low. Occasionally, I would fly nice and low. If you have off radar, I occasionally fly nice and high. I drop off and parachute off, but just make sure your parachute's kind of depends on what kind of day it is because it's pretty easy to see a parachute dropping off. It's pretty easy, so that's the only downside. But yeah, and until the crate drop says three hours, um, I would just what we well, yeah, until it says three hours, wait at Maze Bank. As soon as it says three hours, get in there, and until the crate drops, um, I'll be right back, guys. Okay, guys, I just got the alert um, for um, it's going to spawn three hours. Just got the alert. As you can see, everyone, a lot of people are in Heli's Hydras. Well, not anymore. There was a lot. I had to change out because I got on my thing for a second. I know where this guy was off radar. I just blew it up. So I got And it said three hours. So I get in the air when it says three hours. Get ready. Get pretty high. Get ready. And as soon as it spawns, when you're close enough, disable pass mode just before you're about to parachute off. Because you want to disable it. You're going to jump off. You're going to apply your parachute. And you want to... I wouldn't leave on pass because you got to kill the people. They're just going to smoke you, all right? So make sure you take off pass all right? And until it spawns, bear it back. All right, guys. So you definitely guys can see it spawn, and here it is on the map. All I will do is get you away on the map, and as soon as it spawns, guys, just haul ass there. Just give it all you got. Just get there is all we're worrying about right now. Just get there. As soon as you're starting to get close, I'd suggest taking on pass mode because you're going to see people. I'm not sure if I'll make it. But even if I don't make it, it's still a pretty good strategy. You guys got to get me right, right? This guy is stupid because he has pass mode on. He is going to die as he's going to find out. As he's going to parachute down, he is going to die. It looks like he still has pass mode on. He does not understand that it's going to be pretty tough leaving on pass mode. It's going to be tough. And you're going to hydras everywhere. It's going to be tough. It's not going to be easy. Definitely not going to be easy. You'll see the flare wherever the flare goes. I don't see a flare. I guess next gen might not have flares. Um, I highly don't know, but this works for all gens. Just letting you know, it's just a strategy. It's not a glitch or anything. Here's a spatial crop been dropped. As you guys can see, most likely this place is flooded with people. Do I think I'm going to get it? No. But we'll see. You gotta have faith. Gotta have faith, right? Gotta have faith. Looks like this kid's going to get it. Yeah, yep, and he got it. But anyways, guys, that's a good strategy, guys. And he, he is retarded. As you see right now, he was going to die. Earlier, he wouldn't have died if those people didn't clear the place out. And yeah, that's all for today, guys. I just want to do a quick uh, strategy because they are going to, people are going to put on pass mode. Do what I put on pass mode? No, it's an idiotic idea. Unless someone else comes over here and clears those these red dots like this one guy did, what he did. This other guy cleared them all. So yeah, 
it's a good strategy how to get it guys it, it for me so far it's worked all the time but this time i've never had any issues this session's been pretty chaotic everyone's been killing each other see there's four people over here pass mode i think it's idiotic idea to do it i honestly think it's very idiotic and i think you're not going to get it if you do it you, you guys can prove me wrong this guy this guy uh proved me wrong uh, but these other uh, these other um, guys definitely cleared up, cleared out the place for them, so that's what helped them. But yeah, that's all for today's video, guys. I just want to make a little um, quick little strategy guy that kind of help you out, so you guys don't just see the thing dry, get that you just fly a plane there without passing or anything. So yeah, that's all for today's video, guys. Make sure you hit that like button and subscribe because I upload daily Grand Theft Auto Five content. And until next time, guys, I am out.